big bad bully black. And I've got my, this is a video response to Sean's video, aka Alan's Patriot. His video was titled, Heath Slater is the best, Heath Slater is the best in the world of what he does. And Sean's reason for this was that Heath Slater defeated Chris Jericho during their little stint on NXT. Well Sean, I have a little interesting fact for you that might blow your fucking mind. Um, the Friday Night Smackdown, the one before Money in the Bag, the last Smackdown actually, Heath Slater was the one who lost the match, and he lost the match to the man who I consider the best in the world at what he does, and that man is Justin Gabriel. Justin Gabriel is miles ahead. He is miles better than Heath Slater. Heath Slater is a mug. Justin Gabriel is a legend in the making. Now everybody is... I, I posted... Sean, you know about the little topic that I posted on a wrestling forum. Comparing the two and most people would agree with me. Heath Slater is a mug and I don't like him. Now some people have been saying to me that Heath Slater impressed them because he did a corkscrew? Really? Oh my god, you people are kind of dumb. It doesn't take a freaking professional to throw yourself over the ropes and spin in midair, punks. Sean, even you can do that. Hell, even Serious Sam, he can do that. And Serious Sam can hardly pull off an arm drag. No offense, Sam. I know you're a world champion and all in Dublin City Wrestling. But man, you gotta learn the basics, punk. But anyways, Heath Slater is nothing more than a... You know what? He has nothing, actually, because he's not even a mid-carder. It's... You can... Maybe in five weeks or so, when WWE finally announced these um, cutbacks in the roster, you know when they, when they start to fly off people, so I guess we're going to see Heath Slater on the future endeavor list. So Sean, Justin Gabriel, he beat Heath Slater. So that, and does, that using your logic, does indeed make Justin Gabriel the best in the world at what he does. 